share with you five basic apps you need for your YouTube channel. I'm giving you this for free, no charge, okay? So don't say I didn't do anything for you, all right? <laughs> free app, you don't need to pay, you don't need to subscribe. All right, these are the apps I use. I have more, but some of all these apps you have to subscribe. So I'm going to be telling you the ones that you can use for free and their services are still bomb, okay? So number one is iMovie. I use iMovie to edit my videos, right? Okay. iMovie is for um, iPhone user, okay? So if you are an iPhone, iPhone user, you already have it on your phone, like it comes with um, your phone. You go to, you see it on your phone, you see, you see it on your phone, iMovie. Okay, so with iMovie, you can create a video with you with time you can create your video you can edit your videos with iMovie you can also do uh, a video clip like a trailer and all that good stuff all right like this is for iphone user yes android users just let me group chats <laughs> all right okay number two app i video shop yes i use video shop to edit my videos as well video shop is easy it's easy to use and in shot as well but to be truthful i use in, i use in shot just once or twice like i don't know i when i see what i like i know what i like i, I like what i like all right so when i use in shot i didn't like i didn't really like the effect and everything but it's a good app as well for you to use you have to dance around it and know how it's Done, like how you can use it manage it and everything then for uh, my intro and also use intro maker to create your intro okay and um, I realized one trick if you're using intro maker to create your intro like this intro for if you check back my videos during summer one of my vlogs I'm gonna put it up here I use intro maker what I did is intro maker if you're not subscribed to them they would want the watermark to show like so you don't want it to show like in my case when editing your video like you can save the you can save the intro that you've created and when editing your videos all you have to do is put um maybe like a subscribe icon or write your name you know just get creative and use it to cover the watermark line that way they will not know where you did the intro from all right and also when you are using a generic uh, app like that i call it generic because the whole world is using intro maker to do their this thing so when you are using uh when you're using an app like that that you know everyone is um, using all you have to do is to be very very creative like me oh my god in as much as i love you but i don't want to do what you are doing <laughs> like i always want to be creative you know and when i'm just in that moment of trying to create something like intro and all the rest i just get creative and be like oh no this person has used this i'm going to change it okay so when you're using intro when you're using intro maker try to be very creative because you can actually you can actually edit remove modify right you know so yes try and get creative when using intro maker okay and another app i think is very useful that i use as well for my thumbnail not all my thumbnails but that i use for my thumbnail would be fonto fonto is not photo it's fonto i'm going to write it so you can understand okay it's called fonto um why i like fonto you can be creative you can like font fonto for me it gets my mind busy you know like you can crop you add this you remove this you add this image you put this you know you just have to be creative fonto is free like it's free you don't have to pay for fonto except you want to go professional like the way i'm going now I... <laughs> but anyway except you want to go professional then you can use uh, professional apps like adobe rush uh, premiere and the rest okay all those ones you don't get it for free you can be creative use it for free well they will still see your, your the watermark and everything but if you want to get really professional and creative 
then you have to go for all those bigger apps as well okay but today i'm not going to be giving you five or like basic apps for your youtube channel okay and another app i think that would be useful for your um your pictures like you know when you when you're uploading your thumbnail you need to have crisp crisp is it crisp or oh, crispy crispy clear pictures would be your facetune or insta side that is just jara adding to the five i mentioned okay so for your videos like i mentioned iMovie, video shop uh in, in short photo and all right with these few points of mind what are you waiting for go download it and start getting creative like give us bomb bomb <laughs> Anyway, give us bomb intros and thumbnails. But anyway, Sha, if you still have issues creating, what are you waiting for? Join my membership. <laughs> Join my membership, and I'm going to put you through, you know, and show you, and show you the way. All right. So if you if you're still having issues with everything I've said, and you still find it difficult to be creative, no wahala, I got you. Just join my membership look for the perks that has to do with creating thumbnails and all that good stuff and i'll be right here to help you out okay thank you so much for watching t gangs you already know bye bye